Wow! Welcome back to the channel. Today we are on Lake Underhill in Orlando, Florida. We're gonna go out, do some fishing. We're gonna do some shiner fishing today, so we should catch a bunch of fish. Hopefully it'll be pretty exciting. Uh, this lake is 150 acres. It's all catch and release managed for trophy bass right in downtown Orlando. So this is a great place to come fish. Hopefully we'll check it out and show you what the lake has to offer today. And if you're new to my channel, go ahead down below and hit the subscribe button for me. I'm trying to reach at least a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. So if you could help me out with that goal, it would be greatly appreciated. Oh, 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 get him, get him. There it is. Right on the edge of that hydrilla. He's tiny. Yep. I mean, right on the edge of that hydrilla. There's one. First one of the day. I don't think he's very big. Where are you at, buddy? Oh, he's got to be tiny. He lo The shiner looked bigger than him. He's not that bad. He's bigger than I thought. A one and a half pounder to start the day. We're gonna throw him back. Did yours go under? Oh! Oh! <laughs> that was awesome! He ate that so good. He's probably just sitting in those pads down there. That was over five. Yep. <laughs> Get the net. That's a big girl. Oh, he didn't get him. Ah, there we go. That's a big bass. I'd say seven. It's my new PB, I can tell you that. Six, two, three. Oh, six, two, three. Six, two, three. Oh. Oh, there he goes. He's gone. Yeah. Nope. Did he get him? There you go. Yeah. He may not be little. No. He's good, though. Decent fish. Yep. As soon as I pitched that out there, I just saw a white blob come over and grab him. Where's he at? A little one and a half pounder on a shiner. I'd get him once he turns away, because right now he's swimming towards you. I'm coming back with you. I'm gonna get this on video. Can't get tight. Get him. Big one? Not huge, but not little. It's a good one. That's a good fish. Look, your shiner's still alive. <laughs> Look at this. You get him? <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's gone. <laughs> he's gone. Really? Yep. Oh, now he's back up. Oh! Oh, it's another big one. Is it really? I didn't see it. Yeah. Yeah. I did not see it. Yours is gone too. Oh my, that's a big one. He has a bait in his mouth. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> There's about a three pounder on another shiner. We're gonna throw him back. So that bass that I just caught had a random tube with a storm jig head. It's a good idea. Explains why it broke off. I got another one. Shut up. Yep. Throw it right back in the same spot? Yep. It literally instantly went down. Shut up. He's little. Decent? No. Don't throw my shiner off. I can still use that. All right, guys, there's another one for the day. I don't think he's going to help our bag, but we'll take a look just in case. Nope, he is not going to help today, so we're going to throw him back. 
Oh, there we go. I got it. Come on. Gone. Is it really? <laughs> yep. Yes. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Really? Yeah, it's giant. Okay. Never mind, he's not that big. Okay. He was just pulling very hard. Come on off of there. Come on. Seriously? You're not yeah. even that big. No, I got him. Ooh. He came off. He came off? No, he came off the dock. Yeah. That was a crazy catch. That's the second time I've had that happen on this dock where I got stuck and had to go in and get them. Except the last one was like five and a half pounder. <laughs> There's a pretty good one there. We're gonna go ahead and throw her back and try and catch another big one. Wow. Oh my gosh. This has got to be a giant. This has got to be big. Did you see them peel and line off there? Wow. Yeah, need the net? I'm gonna need the net. <laughs> he was peeling line off of there. I could barely even set the hook on him. How big is he? Ah, uh, oh, that's a bass. He's not even that big. He was very aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> There's a four and a half ish pounder. We're gonna go ahead and throw her back. She's gone. We have 26 and a half pounds for our best five now, so we'll keep going. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, leave a like down below for me. By the time you see this, I will be back in Pittsburgh, so there'll be some more footage coming up from that. We're gonna be doing some different stuff besides Florida bass fishing for a little while. And I have a new big camera on the way, so hopefully the quality of these videos will get a lot better. I'm hoping to work a lot more on this YouTube channel for you guys, so make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any more of these fishing tips or videos. Thanks for watching.